Okay guys, so welcome to this video looking at a tricky indice problem for GCSC 9 to 1 maths for the higher tier only. So this is for higher tier, but this may also be appropriate revision for AS pure level math students, so students doing their A level maths this year as well. Okay, question 18 guys here, yeah, and it's from the Edexcel June 2022 paper, or May 2022 last paper, sorry. Okay, question 18, work out the value of 5 and 4 ninths to the power of minus a half times four and two thirds all divided by two to the minus three. Okay, you must show all your workings. So break it bit by bit. So let's work out this first part. So writing this as an improper fraction, I'll do nine times five, which is gonna be forty five, plus the four is gonna be forty nine. So I'm gonna have forty nine ninths to the power of negative a half or minus a half. Okay, I'm now going to change this into an improper fraction, so 3 fourths are going to be 12, plus the 2 is going to be 14, so I'm going to have 14 thirds, okay, and then this is all divided by, now 2 to the minus 3 guys, hopefully you're happy that that's equal to 1 over 2 cubed, which is equal to 1 over 8, okay, so 1 over 8, okay, so I'm dividing my answer by 1 8, okay, now this will become clear in a minute, actually, yeah, so, essentially, I'm, I'm going to be multiplying this sum by 8, basically, because dividing by a fraction, you tell by it's reciprocal. Okay, so working out this bit here, so the negative does the reciprocal, so I have 9 49ths to the power of a half. Okay, so what this means is that will be the square root of 9 49ths. The square root of the top, square root of the bottom, I'm going to get 3 sevenths. Okay, so I'm going to have 3 sevenths multiplied by 14 thirds. Okay, all divided by 1 eighth. Okay, I'm going to cross cancel it here or cross simplify. So that's going to go with that. So cross simplify. So 1 and 1. Okay, dividing top and bottom by 7. Okay, 1 and 2. So here I will get 1 times 2, which is 2. So I'll get 2 out of 1 divided by 1 eighth. Which is the same as saying 2 divided by 1 eighth. Now when you divide by a fraction, Okay, you multiply by its reciprocal, so dividing by an 8th is the same as multiplying by 8 over 1, or just 8. Okay, so I'll get 2 times 8, which is going to be 16. So our final answer, guys, is 16. Okay, and that was quite a tricky and nasty higher tier index problem. Okay, there was a lot going on there. Okay, the negative power does the reciprocal. Okay, power of a half means the square root. Okay, power of minus 3 means 1 over 2 cubed. Okay, or 1 over that number cubed. Okay, and that's how we get our answer. Okay, hopefully that makes sense. Okay, sorry about my handwriting here, guys. Okay, hopefully it's legible yet, yeah, and hopefully you can read it. Yeah, let's just put that as a minus three to make it clearer. Okay, so that's how to work it out, guys. Okay, yeah, so here, when I worked it out, okay, I crossed simplified it here. So I, I divided the the corresponding terms by 3 first, divided the other corresponding terms by 7, so I get 1 times 2, which is 2, 1 times 1, 1 is going to be 1, so I get 2 once, which is just equal to 1, 2 divided by 1 eighth, so remember, when, when you divide by a fraction, okay, so divide by a fraction, okay, I've got a video actually on the channel already on this, okay, you keep a flip chain, so you keep the first fractional number the same, you multiply by its reciprocal, okay, and you get 16 over 1, or 16 once, which is just 16, guys, okay, and that's my final answer, okay, hopefully that makes sense, okay, any questions, any queries, put it in the comments below, thank you so much for watching, okay, please like, comment, share, subscribe, and follow me on my TikTok page, guys, okay, I'll see you in the next one, bye for now.